Twitter. I am a zoology student, and this is my YouTube channel. Um, this YouTube channel is majorly about um, animals, and most especially wild animals. And today I'm going to be talking about the lion, the king of the jungle. <sighs> well, I believe that is ecologically wrong. Lions don't live in the jungle, so I don't think that makes them the king of the jungle. Lions live majorly in the savanna or grassland area, so that makes them the king of the savanna. Well, have you ever thought about the reason why lions are called king in the first place? Like, why? Tigers are also fierce and stuff, but why, 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 why are lions called king of the jungle or king of an animals? Whether you can answer the question or not, watch this video. Is a large cat of the genus Panthera leo, and they are majorly natives of Africa and India. Now, lions are very, very muscular. I mean, they are big animals. They are muscular. They are strong, and they have a very, very long tail. When I mean a long tail, they have a tuft around their tail at the end of their tail. Now, lions weigh about 190 kilograms. I mean, male lions. And female lion weighs about 130 kilograms. Now, lions have so many special features. One of them is the lion have a bite force of about 650 pounds. Normal humans have a bite force of 150 pounds. And a small kid, when they bite you, I mean, a kid, a baby doesn't have a strong jaw. When they bite you, you know the pain you are going to feel. Now, imagine a lion with a 650 pounds bite force oh my god you don't want to experience that and apart from that lion has about 80 kilometer per hour of speed guys they are not the fastest because of their body weight and their muscle and their stuff but 80 kilometer per hour is one hell of a speed so when they hunt or when they pursue you run for your life there are nothing less than eight species of lion Although these lions look very much alike, but they can be dif differentiated based on their physical features and the regions where they are mostly found. The first on the list is the Asiatic lion. The Asiatic lions are found in India. They have le less developed mane and they are slightly smaller than most African lions. Number two. We have the Barbary lion. The Barbary lion are natives of Atlas Mountain of the North Africa. They are considered to be extinct and they are one of the biggest lions to exist. Number three, we have the West African lion. The West African lion is also known as the Senegal lion. They have a population of less than 1,000 and they are what? They are endangered species. Number four, we have the Northeast or the Congo lion. These lions are native of Uganda and Congo. They have a less developed mane and they are also part of the endangered species. Number five, we have the Maasai or the East African lions. These lions are majorly from Nubia. They have a mane that looks like it is being combed backward. They have longer legs and they have a less curvy back. Number six, we have the Southwestern African lion. The Southwestern African lion are found majorly in Southwestern Africa, in countries like Zimbabwe, Angola. Zambia and the likes. They have a lighter mane and they are also found in the Transvaal region of Southern Africa. 
we have the Transvaal lion or the Southeast African lion. That is number seven. They are found in Transvaal region of South Africa. They have well-developed mane and the mane is also very black. They are the same species as most of the South East African lion. Number eight, we have the white lion. The white lion is the same species as the Southeastern African lion. They are white in color due to color mutation, a recessive trait found in lion. They are very rare and found only in zoos, sanctuary, and wildlife reserve area.